I wish sometimes Dr. Oz would get a segment completely right. Recently, he focused in on uh, silver fillings, and they were talking about the pros and cons of silver versus the white fillings, and did a reasonable episode on that. But he started a segment by holding a thermometer and saying, gee, you know, if I just drop this thermometer, the mercury would spill, and we'd have to evacuate the studio because of the toxic mercury vapor. Well, this is just nonsense. We know about mercury vapor. We know how much it takes to cause toxicity. It has been studied. In one classic case, they took the equivalent of the amount of mercury in a thermometer such as this and left it in an open dish in an office setting with reasonable ventilation and with an instrument measured the mercury vapor in the air around the spilled mercury over several months. And never did the level rise to more than one one hundredth of the level that is deemed by Occupational Safety and Health Administrations to be a safe level. So he just was totally wrong about that. What about the mercury vapor escaping from the fillings in our mouth, which of course is, was the focus of the, of the whole episode? Well, they had a little uh, apparatus there that claimed to show that the mercury was evaporating from a model teeth that were filled with amalgam. Well, this was not realistic. Realistic studies have been done, and uh, those also have shown that when you do this properly and you approximate the environment of the mouth, you would have to have about 135 fillings to reach a blood level of mercury that would be considered toxic. Of course, that was never mentioned. So just once, I wish Oz would get everything completely right.